Hi guys, we are going to become an illustrator this week. I'm really excited about this one. It's kind of a passion of my own. And I thought how better to explain what being an illustrator is than bringing the words of an actual illustrator in. This is an artist that we studied a couple of years ago named Lauren Lowen. And she wrote me a little card actually not me, my students. So that's you guys. She wrote me a card explaining what an illustrator is. Here, I'll hold it up here as I read it. It says, in case you didn't know, I am what you call an illustrator. This means I make art for things like books and magazines and fun things you use every day like journals and stickers. I've always been a creative and now I'm lucky to have a fun job that I love. If you want to be a creative in a creative job when you get older, you can keep a sketchbook and take art classes in school and even go to a special college that is focused on art and design. But don't forget about your other classes because those are important too. And you can always have several interests as a person. Good words from Miss Lowen. That was an excellent way to explain what an illustrator is. So I'm going to give you four different ways that you can become an illustrator for this week. Ways that you can become an illustrator this week is by drawing with Mo Williams. He is the illustrator who made these amazing characters. He's doing videos on a pretty regular basis with the Kennedy Center and he's calling them lunch doodles. These are so much fun. They're nice and simple this might be your option that you want to try. Another option you might want to take up is becoming a collage artist to illustrate a picture. So this is our inspiration piece. It is by Susie Altman, and she is an Instagram artist that I know of and now follow all thanks to this teacher named Shannon Ruby. Shannon used her piece Susie's piece to make this video right here. It shows how to collage artwork to make a character that kind of is in the inspiration of Susie Altman. And here's another option. You can become a comic book artist. This is another way to illustrate a story is through a comic book. And I actually might change this page just a little bit because I wrote the artist, Dave McDonald, who has a YouTube channel and shows how to make comic books. I wrote him to make sure that it was okay to use his images. He was excited about that and said absolutely and he said he might even give a shout out to Hassan Elementary. So if you see another video here you'll know that's the one where he calls out Hassan Elementary for taking on the challenge of making comic books. The last option is to become an illustrator by creating your own character. This is a piece of artwork by Lori, Lauren Lowen, the same person that we talked about at the beginning here of this week's um, challenge, becoming an illustrator. So that's her work. And she was the inspiration for this lesson that I did a couple of years ago at Prairie View. This goes over how to create your very own character for illustration. And this is the letter that I read to you at the very beginning. So you can read the whole thing right here. Now it's your turn to become an illustrator. Be sure to share on Seesaw or on Flipgrid what you created this week.